give a chance at a distance phone calls and emails so i'm thinking about doing some stuff like that um trying to make some business cards so people could call me and ask me questions and i could get them advice and guidance and uh of course it's gonna be a fee you know like a little personal reading or whatever or advice because i don't Look at intuition. <laughs> yeah, because, and then it says, How give a chance at a distance of surprising kids or take care of those around you or a bonnet? How? Oh, it's a phone calls and email. You don't put in too much work to let these same group of people come in and try to distract you again. Because they've already told you, showed you multiple times. <laughs> they try to manipulate your black magic, wifey material, the boyfriend, and kids. So they don't want you to look a type of way to somebody because they enjoy taking stuff from you because it's so easy. Or not because it's easy, but because you don't fight back and you allow them to take it. Yes, how bad do you really want it? So it could be asking the karma, like, how bad do you really want this forgiveness enough to give up this divine masculine or enough to expose the truth of why you approached this divine masculine or tell, like, you feel me? She didn't, like, real life. I did this because of what they told me. I was like that. <laughs> and they could have said because divine feminine slept with my man, this and the third, blah, blah, blah. But it also could be because blessings and wealth and abundance. You are protected in whatever decision you choose to choose. But just know that if you choose this masculine, you're going to have to, you know. But if you choose this opportunity, you're going to have to leave these people behind. And focus your direction on what it is you love to do. The truth about some kids. Or take care of those around you and tell the truth. Yeah, so you either tell the truth or get into a fight because you're not allowing these other karmics who are willing to make that change to be able to make the change because you're being selfish. And the karmic like that because now she has these um karmics at her disposal. So she probably making them, so she probably going to make them pay her debt off and then she'll let this masculine go. But when she does that, she going to be lonely and ain't going to have nowhere to go to turn. Like, because when this masculine leaves, she going to be but It's like, she. Because <sighs> when I first started this, this was like almost a year ago. Um, was saying to go back to your grandma house. And that's another reason why I didn't want to move in with nobody because. I'm not going to move in with you just to get put right back out to be it because I won't do what you want me to do. 
instead of draining someone else's energy from someone else drain pick yourself up get your energy back from that person so like if somebody took your man don't don't blame your kids because he chose to go over there and take care of somebody else's kids insecure it was meant to happen yeah they they find a weaker person or a person of a lower vibration to take their frustrations out on curiosity and adventure and i see a car so it's like once you get this car you're going to be able to get out more and do more and spend more time with your kids or just you know i don't know something like that Yeah, traveling. Or some alone time is very important. <laughs> I'm anxious about this. Can't even tell y'all because there's some hoes watching and listening that I love. To mess up my energy and my mood. So I'm going to wait until after it happened. Then I'm going to tell what happened. Anyways, help the devil understand what could have happened. Because of background. So divine feminist definition of helping the devil is to get him to see where he went wrong. How to change it. And how not to continue to do what he do if he want to see his deity. And then the karmic to help the devil is to continuously put stuff on his tab that he got to get rid of so that's why he get these people to do things because he's telling them like don't be throwing dirt on my name or using my energy to manipulate the situation and make it seem like i put you up to it and then it's like well since you don't believe me i'm gonna make them do it and i'm gonna prove you that you know when you're supposed to prove them wrong like don't prove them right prove them wrong had a cake and eat it too. Tried to make themselves make this masculine believe that they was the real divine. Okay. Yeah, because I had somebody tell me that I look like an eater. And how the hell I look like an eater when I ain't even been with nobody? Like, I'm just fresh new to the area. If I was such an eater, I would have done you and, and your homie and your other homie. Like, I would have been ran through by now. So, who, when, and why? And because they thought it was sweet. They thought you was the easy target. They thought, like, sh like, yeah. Because before you even told him, like, yeah, she must not hold grudges because I don't, you feel me? She never confronted me about, because you know, I don't do stuff for people hoping for something in return. And if you, if you offer it, then okay. And if you don't do it, I ain't going to press you about it because you offered it, you probably might have changed your mind. Karma, leadership, evolving, day is being returned to sender, and you're getting abundance. <laughs> Wealth and abundance. So it's like you you confront the devil and you know that he's trying to tempt you. But yeah, it's like in a 5D, I could resist temptation. But in a 3D, that's a whole nother story. And then it's like, dang, I just resisted you in the 5D. Why did I 
get tempted in the 3D. Mm -mm. Round two. So if these karmics are not sure if Divine Feminine knows about what all went down, they're going to test her and try her again. This time, when you get your downloads about these karmics, you must prepare for the um, defuse when you defuse the situation. So you either going to, you know, get them a test of their own medicine or you're going to just still be you and, you know. Blessings, body, mind, and spirit. Uh, asking you shall receive. Caught up in a misunderstanding. Keep quiet. So I feel like your opportunity is going to come back around to you. And this time you're going to take it. But you can't say nothing about no, Can't say nothing about it to nobody. And they're going to be like all in your business but that's why they said to if you're reading a book to become that person in the book so if they ask you like yeah what you been up to like oh um i went here and there you know for a couple months and i was doing this and that for a couple months but this masculine opportunity don't get greedy or don't get too excited when he come back around or you know, don't be too in a rush to take the opportunity, depending on what your situation is. Like, if you have a contract to sign, don't be so thirsty to sign it. So since these karmics couldn't get to you, they're going to send this masculine in to get to you. They've been watching you to see how to manipulate you, what type of schedule you've been on, and if anything has changed about you. Uh, yeah, a bunch of entertainment when you're living for real life. And they say you need to stop living like that because don't nobody care. And it's like, well, don't talk to me because I do. At first, God thought Divine Feminine switched sides. Group didn't know because they were imitating Divine Feminine after the hard work. Looked like Divine Feminine using being sneaky tests. Divine Feminine Pat has been enough evidence on imposters. So you had to be the way that you were to get these group, these third party people to get caught for using your energy and making you try to be in this low vibration so there's a difference between manipulating somebody and sticking up for yourself it sounds the same but one of them is to get you in a low vibration and one of them is in self-defense so because i tell y'all once that happened and i'm gonna let that fall once that happened I was over, like, I, I don't know. Like, you know, you be off it, but then something happens, or you walk outside and be real, and that cold hit you and be so. That's how it was. It's like I'm doing all this work. Yeah. But because of what I allowed these comics to do with my energy while they had it, and it's not like you're allowing them to do something. It's the simple fact that when you find out what they did, you have to defend yourself and you feel me? You have to tell them, like, no, you feel like so. If you ever find somebody trying to throw dirt on your name, you gotta correct them and tell them, no, daddy, don't be putting words in my mouth. Don't hesitate to run a feminine backstab, but it's a mystery. I'm sorry. They said don't read it out like that. Mm. 
Yeah, so it sounds good about how it'll play out, but when, why, and who. And then what's going to happen, and because of who they were, you know, it's like, can I trust you? Can I not trust you? Should I give you a second chance? How will I know when to walk away from the situation? Because, you know, it's too good to be true. Basically, for proving your innocence, you for evolving, we understand mistakes happen. You was caught up in a mistake. And although you didn't uh, defend yourself at the time, it could have been years later that you found out what actually happened, that you defended yourself. And now that's why everything is starting to backfire and people are being called into judgment and everything like that. Because at the time, you didn't know. You thought that you was just doing your role. And now it makes sense as to why you in the situation that you in. But by telling your story and helping others and not trying to manipulate people or confuse people or, you know. But please like, comment, and subscribe. I appreciate all 11 of y'all. I only get about like. Maybe four viewers on average. But I appreciate the people that do view me. I got a couple likes. That's good. My video had some likes on it. But you just gotta... And I, I know I sound childish or softly spoken or whatever, but my throat be dry. <laughs> and I tried to make some tea, but um, I ain't got no sugar. Gotta go get some sugar and send a drink for these children. I'm not talking real life children. I'm talking about my children. Two boys. Um uh six